Yo, what's going on? It's your boy King J. King of Fighters 15 have released a new trailer of the season two DLC. Now, the reason why I think I'm interested in this one, maybe, is because they're releasing characters singular. This game is a 3v3 tag game. And the first season pass was crazy. They had loads of different teams. You had Team Garrow, Team Samurai Showdown, Team Southtown. Yeah, it was a really good season pass. So I don't think they're going to be able to top it off. But yeah, let's have a look at this one. And yeah, I'll give my verdict at the end as per usual. Okay. Dun, 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 that Shingo theme. Okay. Oh, okay. He looks good in this. It looks pretty good. Okay. Oh, he's got a special intro of Kyo. Oh, he looks quite slim. Oh, it's got a critical effect that he has in the old school games. Nice. Whoa, that Shingo kid looks mad. And he falls down on his head as well. Oh, okay, they got that. That's sick. Oh, he remembers him from King of Fighters 11. Oh. Okay. So, those events did happen then. No? Alright, cool. Oh, yes. And it hits him in the back fist. <laughs> right, let me see that again. That actually looked quite sick. And he got a classic costume as well. I don't really like that that um, climax. To be fair. Oh, there's more. Oh, there's a render for Kim now. Sick. He looks sick. Sylvie. Nudged. What? That Jaehun maybe Jaehun. I don't know. I don't know who that character could be. Is that it for the season pass? Wait one second. Wait one second. We need to talk about this. Is that it for the season pass? As in, you lot came that you lot come from Geese, Yamazaki, Billy Kane, Rock Howard, B. Janet, Gato, to Shingo, Kim, Sylvie, Nagd. And two other characters. So you now have gone from teams to doing singular. I wonder how the King of Fighters community actually... I, I'm just a bit... I'm a bit confused. Because there's a bunch of characters. There's a bunch of teams that could be put into the game. You know, you've got Shen. You've got, like, all of those characters. You've got Shen, Duelon, Oswald. That's a team. You know, you could have bought Kim and his sons. That would have been a team. You know, because we're doing this whole universe thing. Like, there's so much other characters, so much other teams that you could have done. But it seems like they're just using the King of Fighters Season 2 update roadmap for singular characters. Sylvie. Oh, man, I don't know if this, this... this I don't know about this character being in the game. She looks like she's very, like, goth now. The wings and the dark eyeshadow and, you know, the feathers are black now. Uh, Naj, I didn't think was ever gonna come back. I thought Ki I thought she was just a King of Fighters uh, fourteen character that was a DLC that had no kind of relationship with none of the characters. So it's good to kind of see that she's back in this one. Maybe she has some type of relation with you know Dolores and Kukri. No idea, but it's good to see that this character is in the game. Um, 
I don't know who the other two characters are gonna be, and I don't, I don't necessarily feel like this DLC is gonna excite me that much. These four characters that they've shown, man, with Street Fighter Five, no, with Street Fighter Five, um, pretty much ending and Street Fighter Six coming out with that excitement, then Tekken Eight, I really don't want King of Fighters Fifteen to drown. I really feel like they could do a lot more. If this is what the whole we have to watch. You know, because we're going to watch these trailers, right? The trailers before when the game came out was absolutely amazing. The season the season one DLC was amazing. But now it's like, all right, I've got to wait. I've got to wait for Sylvie, Naj, and Kim Kafwan. Kim Kafwan is, is, a, is a sick character, so I'll really be interested to that. But Sylvie, Naj, and then finding out the extra two characters, I mean, man, I don't know, man. I don't know. But I guess we've got character refinements to look out for and we've got cross-platform to look out for. But again, it's not really that exciting, I'll be honest. <laughs> yeah, um, I, I guess the Shingo trailer was cool. Like... I'm definitely not gonna like like I think the Shingo trailer was cool. Seeing Shingo back in the game is sick. Uh it's been a while. But we could have Shingo, we could have had uh Kyo's dad, and we could have had Goro Diamond as one team. Like I don't I'm not really sure about the singular like why would you be releasing singular characters when you've got like Tekken and Street Fire coming up? Like you're gonna make people lose their interest in the game. They're gonna be like, alright, see the Street Fire 6 come out, alright, buy a King of Fires. You know, then it's going to be back to like, you know, how it was before where there's not going to be much people playing the game and it's going to go, it's going to, it's just going to go quiet. We might not even have a season pass free. So I, I really want to see how this works. I, I'm going to be open minded and, you know, that that's just my personal opinion. You know me, I, I like to, just, I like to speak open minded about things. Again, I have, will have my own opinions and it might not be the, what everyone else agrees on, but yes mm, we'll wait and see let me know what you lot think in the comment section please because i really want to know like if you're watching this video and you're a king of fighters fan i don't want you to feel like oh i'm alienating the game but i want to know what you lot think personally like do you think these characters are good for king of fighters 15 as dlc season pass 2 do you think that you know they're not good do you think you know king of fighters is gonna is this gonna help king of fighters 15 I don't know, man. But you lot can let me know in the comment section down below. And yeah, I'll respond back to you lot as soon as possible. Take it easy, everyone. Peace.